When working on a post, you can easily link to other content, whether it's external content, like linking to, let's say, the New York Times uh, for reference, or linking to internal content, such as a page or a post within your website. I'm on this post here called Darien Sales Report, May 2011. And what I'm going to do is create a link to internal content. So to do that, I'm simply going to come down here. And in this sentence, in May 2011, 29 single homes uh, sold, 14 more the previous month. I'm going to highlight the words previous month. And then in the text editor, you will see this icon when you hover over it, it says insert edit link. If I click on that, it gives me a couple options in this pop-up menu. If you're linking to external content, such as the New York Times, you'd simply go to the New York Times, copy the URL to the article that you want to reference, and then paste the URL in this field. And then for title, you put the title of that post, uh, or you can just put the title of the business, such as New York Times. And whenever linking externally, I do recommend that you check this box here to open a link in a new window or tab. In this case, however, I'm going to be linking internally. So to do that, I'm going to click this where it says or link to existing content. When I click on that, you're going to get this drop down here. It's going to show you all the posts and pages that are within your website. Posts are easily identifiable because they'll have the timestamp or date that that post was published here. Pages will just say page to the right. And then on the left here, you have the titles of each page or post. If you can't find the page or post you're looking for, you can simply do a search up here. In this case, I'll do a search for April since I'm going to look for April's uh, sales report. Once that comes up with results, you'll see all your results down here. Simply click on the page or post you want to link to. And when you do that, the system will automatically fill in the URL up here along with the title. And then because this is internal linking, there's no reason to necessarily have this open up in a new window. So I'm going to keep that unchecked. And in the bottom right, just click Add Link. You can see my link has now been added with the title showing up upon hover. If I want to remove that link, Simply highlight the link in question, go up to your text editor, you'll see this icon, unlink, simply click on that, and that will remove the link. Of course, whenever making these changes, when done, make sure you click update and save that. If you have any questions, email molly at realestatetomato.com.